take up your cross and follow me. Dear brothers and sisters, we can have different interpretation of the very word of Jesus in the gospel today, addressing his disciples and also those who wished to follow him at that time. Take up your cross and follow me. The cross, dear brothers and sisters, of which Jesus speaks in this passage today is a symbol of our complete and total commitment, surrender to Him. When we love, we are willing to endure our cross, our pains that may happen in our lives. Due to His love for the Father, Jesus Himself was willing to bear the cross, the greatest course cross that ever happened in his life. For us then, if we love the Father, love Jesus, we will be willing to bear the cross. As Jesus said today, whoever wishes to come after me must deny himself, take up his cross and follow me. Carrying the cross requires, of course, that we believe this is the way to live and the cross of Christ leads us to victory and liberation from sin and death. We are asked ourselves, what cross is currently searing you, searing me, searing us? What keeps this cross in your minds, in your memory, in your hearts, in your lives? Only if we are capable of carrying our crosses, dear brothers and sisters, in the light of the gospel story today, we can love God and love others. Because loving requires bearing the cross the cross that we personally experience in our lives. Let us learn from St. Clair, whose feast we celebrate today, who totally gave her life commitment to the Lord, for her love for the Lord was above everything. <laughs>